Sony decided to drop a sort of teaser for Spider-Man No Way Home and then quickly retitled it, disabled the comments, and is hoping that you didn't notice it while they hype up the third film in the franchise and the biggest one yet, as they promise in the ad. Sony knows Spider-Man fans are hungry for Spider-Man No Way Home. So instead of releasing a teaser or anything more, they release a teaser teasing Spider-Man No Way Home by teasing that the biggest journey is yet to come and stitching together clips of the first two Spider-Man films in the MCU, telling everybody to catch up before they see No Way Home in theaters. Ah, <sighs> Sony... Sony, Sony, Sony. And I mean, they saw the response really quick as the uh, downvotes started to go in and people started to comment. Currently, 7.5k likes, 1.9k dislikes. And um, yeah, it's one of those things where you're looking at it and you're kind of trying to see what's happening and then the comments were quickly disabled and you can't reply on some social media because obviously they see the outrage. They know what they're doing. They know they probably screwed up on this one somewhat because people were expecting a Spider-Man thing to drop and they drop a Spider-Man video, but yeah, it's not the ones fans were hoping for, so they quickly removed the No Way Home from the title on YouTube. <laughs> and now it's just called Catch Up With Homecoming and Far From Home. All right, I mean, we know something is coming. Like, real soon. It has to. But I think why people are more pissed than ever before is because they are not saying anything at all. Just remaining quiet. Nothing. Silence. Absolute zero from anybody. And we've been here before with Avengers Endgame. And now we're here with Spider-Man. And it's reaching this point where people are actively now just hating everything Spider-Man. <laughs> because it's not the Spider-Man they want. Oh, what a, you know, what a problem to have, right? People want your new content so bad that they're hating your old content. I mean, it's a good problem to have because at least they're still clicking stuff and commenting and pushing you in the algorithm. But it's just at this point where, honestly, what more can you say? This company, Sony's always been clueless. Now they're just playing into it. Unless this was... On purpose, they didn't realize that this would cause an uproar in the comments, which if they didn't think it would happen, then they're more clueless than most of us believe. And that's hard to believe because remember, they uploaded a full film to YouTube instead of a trailer. What more can you say?